We've not seen this level of gridlock before out there. With every concert, especially the ones that are sold out concerts, there's always a higher level of traffic gridlock, but it moves along quicker. The Grant County Sheriff's Office is apologizing tonight after thousands of people waited hours to get through a traffic jam at the gorge over the weekend to see the Lumineers. Good evening and thank you for joining us here on Creme 2 News at 5 and 6. I'm Whitney Ward. That show had to be delayed, but even then hundreds were late and many never did make it through the gates in time to see the concert. Creme 2's Janelle Finch traveled to the gorge today to find out what went wrong. Some fans looking forward to seeing the Lumineers perform at the Gorge on Friday were left disappointed. Not because of the band's performance, but because they didn't get to see the performance at all. Two back-to-back -back concerts plus added security measures led to extremely long entry lines, some causing hours of delay. Those delays led to people missing the concert and calling for refunds. Inland Northwest Lumineers fans counted down to the band's performance at the Gorge. Lori McDonald and her daughter had their tickets since March. Definitely excited. McDonald and her daughter left three hours early from Deer Park for the Friday night concert. She says three blocks from the venue, their excitement slowly faded. She said, let's go now. And I was like, sure, that's okay if we're down there early. And we weren't early, we were late. The mother-daughter duo ran into bottleneck traffic from fellow Lumineers fans and future Gorge concert goers. According to Live Nation, doors for the Lumineers open at 5.30 p.m. Friday. But by this time, camping for the Eric Church concert Saturday and Sunday had already opened. Every direction we could look, there was traffic just backed up. Lori McDonald says she and her daughter sat in standstill traffic for hours and missed most of the opening act. People were like getting out of their cars and just walking to the venue. And I don't know what they were doing with their vehicles, but we were considering just leaving our car in a field and walking if we had to. McDonald says she's thankful she was able to see the Lumineers take the stage. But she knows not everyone had the same luck. There were empty seats all around us that never, those people never showed up. The Gorge issued $50 in concert credit for fans who entered the concert after the Lumineers were already on stage. Live Nation on behalf of the Gorge Amphitheater says they are proactively providing a full ticket refund to anyone who missed any part of the Lumineers performance. They say refunds will be processed by Ticketmaster within the next five business days. Earlier this summer, a man was able to bring in a gun to one of the Gorge's campgrounds where he shot and killed two people and injured several others. That deadly situation is what prompted more strict and thorough security measures, which also played a part in the delays in entry. In Quincy, Janelle Finch, Crumpton News.